<laughs> Please, I'll get it out, um, and we'll put your hair back together. Terrific. Thank you. I bet it's not one, because last time it was like 13. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. We'll see. So, what, what, remind me what happened last time? Yeah, so I, um, I went some, I went to another dermatologist, and, um, they, like, took it out, and kind of didn't seem like they did a good job, and it came back. So, I'm actually going to probably make it, like, not a huge incision, but kind of the span of what they did the last time. Okay. Just to make sure I can get everything out. Full stick, sorry. This is the worst part. All right, so the deal with these, though, these are very vascular. The scalpel's very vascular, so it's just got to be, like, a, once I start the procedure, it's got to be ready to dab and stuff. You okay, man? Yeah. It's okay, we have a sharpie. This is the, this is the pain part, um, so you don't have any pain yeah. there. Because of where this cyst is, you likely will have some swelling in your forehead okay. as time goes on. Just because of gravity, things kind of work their way down. Terrific. So don't be alarmed. <laughs> All right, feeling anything sharp, man? Uh, no. You're gonna feel pressure. You should. Yeah. You might feel some pressure. You might feel some pulling. You shouldn't feel anything sharp or painful. You okay? I mean, it feels a little sharp, but it's like. You feeling sharp? Or you feeling pressure? Um, it's like, a... it's like it's like low grade, like a headache kind of pain. It might just be pressing into because there's a lot of anesthesia. Yeah. Now. Let's, let's proceed. It's not like jarring. Let's tell me if it's, yeah. Yeah. Well, I see you looking at me, I just can't get to it yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. What's stopping you? It's just bleeding a little bit, but so I can like it. I can see. Looking at it, just gotta get it out. It's actually kind of one long cyst. Well, that's good. I don't know about the 13 things they took out last time. Well, maybe it grew to fill up the space of the 13 other ones. You okay, man? Mm hmm. Sounds like progress. Mm. You okay? You felt that? No, that was that felt like sound promising. <laughs> Did you get it? I don't know. I still want to do. Dude, this might just be one giant scar, man. There was like a, a, there was like a new one that came and it like hurt a lot. And I, like when I came to see you last time. Yeah. And then like a couple weeks ago, I was just sort of like feeling around and I kind of squeezed it and it popped. So I think there's something. Like uh, something popped out of the top? Yeah. Like it's sort of like, there's like the main thing. There's like this, like how I envision it is like, there's this main thing here, which is what I think you're working on now. And then there's sort of like a break and then there's something beneath it that um, I kind of like squeezed. Yeah, sorry. What are you looking for? Uh, I'm, just, I'm just looking what's in there, seeing what's in there. Is it the lipoma you suspected? I don't know. It's definitely not a cyst, that's for sure. I mean, if it's not a cyst, is it reasonable to think that, like, when this heals, something might come back? Uh, well, I'd say that. You're, I gotta see what it is in the microscope, like, the tissue that I removed, so I'll mm -hmm. let you know. But I don't, not gonna be able to tell you that today. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Thanks, Doc. And team. All right, 
All right, so listen, we removed something that was occupying a significant amount of space in your scalp. So you're naturally gonna, your body's naturally gonna wanna fill this up with blood and see around and stuff. Cool. So you might notice a watering body discharge from the area for a few days. Mm -hmm. No showering. Don't feel, no, you can shower, you can get wet, but just for the next couple of days, you might notice a water body discharge. Um, Stitch is gonna stay in for like 10 days-ish, so you'll come back on the next Thursday, next, you know, Thursday or Friday. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. The other thing is you're gonna have like a little divot in this area for a while until mm -hmm. your body fills it back in. So don't poke it or anything. Okay, good. All right, so Amy's just gonna make sure everything wants to and Amy does some sharps on the paper. Mm -hmm. Amazing. All right, so I'll be in touch with the pathology. Any problems? Wait, can I see it? Can I see the thing? Well, yeah, but let's just get you all set up. Oh, we'll okay. show you. All right, okay, okay, okay. 